hey, hey, y'all. It's your girl, Monique Dior, and I am back with another video. So as y'all can see, I got a little, little skin out today, busting out my crop top. Today is FAMU's Be Out Day ATL edition. Y'all, I've never been before. Um, I'm excited. I was stuck back so y'all can see my outfit. Trying to lay down these big hairs. We gonna see. I know how my hair is, but I got some new products, got some new new tools, trying to trying to try a little something, look halfway like somebody. So um yeah, so that's what we're doing today. Um I don't know what's in store, I don't know what to tell y'all, but we about to go and find out. I'm pretty sure this video won't be too too long, but hey, we'll see. So y'all know what ha what's happening next. We're gonna kick it to the intro and then we will be back. <laughs> Um, I was kind of sad because set was canceled. Um, y'all know I love being on set, but hey, I have no control over that. I'm just background. So that was canceled. So I had to switch this week and, um, I just drove ship all week. Not all week. I did like three, four days. Yeah. Out of the week. Um, and hey, baby, it was lucrative. So I said, all right, as of right now, I don't have no sets for next week. So baby. It's putting wear and tear on my car. That's the part I don't like. But at the end of the day, when I see the amount that I'm able to withdraw, I'm like, okay. All right, sun break, we'll fix it. Yeah, you know, a little razzle dazzle, but that was my week. But today, we are going to go to ATL's Fam You Be Out Day. So it started at 12. Um, Y'all already knew I wasn't going to get there at 12. 12, I was working for my other job. Uh, we had to handle some stuff with that for an event today. So that's what I was working on. And I already knew I wasn't going to get that at 12. Because them DJs that's on the list, I don't know them. I don't know how they I don't know how they get down or whatever. Y'all know me. I'm big on my DJs. My DJs have me spoiled. Loose Kid is performing last. So that's who I really want to see. And I want to see the alumni band. I think they was going on at 3. What time it is? Probably going to miss them. Um, it's like 2.30 right now. But whatever. Uh, but I am going to try and get some footage for y'all today. So y'all can see all the beautiful, lovely people. I'm excited. One, because I've never been. I hear a lot of people talk about it. A lot of people talking about they're traveling to Atlanta to witness it. I'm about to travel to Atlanta to witness it. So... <laughs> um, so yeah, we about to check it out and see what it's about. So... Come on, go with me. Uh. Come on, go to Atlanta. <laughs> Come on, y'all. Let's go. So, y'all, I am here. But this parking is ridiculous. Um... And I get aggravated real quick. <laughs> and baby, I'm aggravated. Trying to find a park shouldn't be this hard. Um. So yeah, I just might pop me a little Yui and going on home because. First of all, I already got to walk 50 miles to get to the actual thing. It's over there. These people got coolers. They got tents. They got bags. <sighs> Y'all, this video might be shorter than I thought. Because, um, one, I can't find anywhere to park. And the way these, some of these people park, I don't trust it. I need my car, you know? And traffic here in Atlanta is ridiculous. And it makes no sense, y'all. Let me zoom out. 
like everywhere all the streets full of people and I don't know what else to do and or say at this point like I'm about to say the hell with it and go home I wish I knew somebody so I can park in their yard or park in their uh, driveway y'all this is crazy like in the park is like five streets over already <clears throat> already like five streets over and I'm not finna keep wasting my gas yes I'm on a full tank of gas but I'm not finna keep wasting it trying to find a park cause this is crazy ma'am you should have charged the park in your yard Yeah, I think I'm about to call my cousin and be like, hey girl, I came, couldn't find a park. So I'm out. Cause this makes no sense. And two, this is what happens when you come late. This started at 12. The time is now four. And yeah. I mean, I ain't got no problem going home. No problem at all going back home. I ain't found them apart. Y'all, in this car too. Oh, you can't see, but this car is behind me. How close we are to these cars, dog. It's really about to be a no for me. Um, But I'll let y'all know, though. Mm. This might be the only footing and sighting that y'all get of them. Because, baby, listen. This is ghetto. I'm still looking for a ride. I mean, a park. <laughs> Sir, move. I'm just, I'm, I ain't even trying to eat out here nothing. I'm over it. But look at all the black folks. Hey, y'all. So, so nice to see my family. Oh, look at Jeremy. Jeremy over there on the grill. Okay. Oh, they got a pee pee. Yeah, it's looking like I'm about to be a homebody. Cause I ain't gonna park. And I don't like this. I tried. I definitely tried. I got here at 4. It's 4.25. That's how long I've been riding around looking for parking. <clears throat> so, yeah. Happy Saturday. So, y'all, I finally found... <clears throat> I finally found a park. <sighs> Lord, I pray that my car is still there. When I come back, in Jesus' name. Amen. I got my chair. Got my bag, got my cup. <sighs> We're here.
as y'all can see, I'm huffing and puffing. Get in my car. Anyway, my first be out day, ATL, in the books. I've learned a lot. Know what to do for next year. I'll tell y'all more when I get in the car and I get settled. Cause talking, walking, trying to breathe and record, ain't working. All right, y'all, I'm in the car. I use the bathroom so bad, but I'm low key kind of sort of somewhat bushy. Ooh, this is bothering me. Y'all see myself in my glasses, so I'm about to take it off. But I'm somewhat sort of kind of bougie, and I don't like public bathrooms. And I'm not finna use the porta potty. So I'm gonna just have a hold of this until I get home or until I get wherever I gotta go. Well, these lashes look good. I mean, anyway, before I get distracted. Oh, yeah. So it was really, really fun. Um, I know going forward next year, what I have to do. You know, the first time you go, it's like an experiment to see the good and bad. The bad is the parking. Bad is you got to get a tent and a park the day before because trying to get it today, baby, it ain't it. Um, but luckily, I did get a good park. Um, my car didn't get towed. I've been here for like two hours. They still going on. They about to shut down in a few though. But, um, so I know next year when I go, food, drink, a tent, yeah, and get here early. Don't be on my time. I got here at four. Well, yeah, I arrived at four and it started at 12. Some people been out here all day, but people bought their kids. They had games. They had, um, you know, just the works out here. It was really fam you fun day, like be out day for real, for real. Um, they say it's the biggest event, you know, outside of homecoming. Oh, come on for knowing how to drive Kappa. Um, they said it's the biggest event outside of homecoming and I can see that and I agree and I understand. I had a good time though. Next year, I'll be here earlier um, and be better prepared. What is this on my lip? Why y'all ain't telling me I had some on my lip? <sighs> I'm just up here talking to y'all. Anyway, um, yeah, it, it was a really, really good day. And y'all, I got to see some of my, you know, old people that I went to school with. And the songs, when he started playing out the Greek song, it really made me feel like I was on set friday when i was a student at famu and i really missed it y'all got to see my favorite ah! y'all know anytime i see the q dogs um or the deltas i get excited they're my favorite too and you know i like to see the sigmas hop around but the q's and the deltas love them down you hear me um and it was good it was really really good seeing people that i went to school with and you know how life treating people well you don't know how life treating but you know you see them they still alive they still look healthy so that's a good thing so yeah it was really really good next year y'all show up because i'm gonna show up um i already told the crew i'm like y'all hey y'all gotta come next year because set up have fun real nice little good time so yeah that was be out day 2022 atl edition i love my family we brag different because we are just us. Ain't nobody messing with us. Ain't nobody topping us. If you ain't fam you lead, I don't know what to tell you. You ain't go to fam you. I apologize. It was an experience that only you will know about if you attend fam you. So I'm done rambling. Um, I really ain't got nothing else to do tonight. But I do need to go home and get in bed because I got a long day tomorrow. <sighs> I don't know. We'll see. Anyway. Thank y'all so much for watching. Be sure to tell a friend or tell Tim that Monique Dior has done it again. And I greatly appreciate each and every one of y'all for watching, comment, like, and sharing, all that good stuff. It means a lot to me. I love y'all. We still on the road to 500. We at 360. Let's keep going up. Let's, let's keep going up. I love y'all. Until next week.